my name is Dwayne Mario. I am a young East Indian, Indian classical dancer. I've been dancing since 2015, where I've trained and also performed at different places all over the country of Belize, including Puerto Barrios, Guatemala. I've performed at Carifesta for Trinidad in 2019, and also Diwali Nagar. And of recently, I've been trained in Vedic Hinduism in Iflot, Guyana of last year in August. And the reason I am putting out this video is to see that I am able to go and study more dancing and be certified in Chennai, India by the school called Kuchipuri Art Academy. This type of dance that I love called Kuchipuri is for everyone. So it is a great way to a good way of exercise, it's a good way to be recre recreational. It's a beautiful dance style that everyone should get into and learn. And like I say, it's for everyone. Male and females do this type of dance. And it is a way of telling a story of the different gods and goddesses and daily life as well through your facial expression, your body movements, hand gestures called mudras, the feet movements. So you're not just an actor or an actress. You're also a dancer telling and recreating the stories. This is not just a way of exercising, like say how you do like yoga, but it's a great way of being artistic and expressing yourself through the art, through dance. You know, basically just being able to show self-expression through dance, through your emotion, through music. While you're dancing, you are a avatar in a sense of portraying the gods and the goddesses. So most of the time you will see the actors, the dancers, they're dressed in the part of like Lord Shiva, Ma Kali. You would see them portraying Ma Durga in her beautiful red sari, her golden trident that she has. So for me, this type of art that I chose for myself of dancing is not just to be on stage, but it's also a spiritual, personal choice for myself because I've chosen Hinduism and it's a spiritual, beautiful spirituality. And it's a way then, when I implement it in my personal life, I can then share with others with being an example, a living example to prove to them the beauty of Hinduism. Basically, the beauty of creating the costumes. It's the same way when you have carnival, you're staying up late, long hours, preparing with a glue gun, with your different rhinestones and different stuff like that, and gemstones, and you're making the costumes. So it's just like carnival, and you're putting the dedication, the time, the effort, and the love into the costume. And after so long, so many hours, you see that costume, and you put it on, and you look in the mirror, and you see your hard work. You feel very, a sense of pride, you sense sense of dedication and a sense of upliftment for yourself and self-respect. And this is what the students will be implementing and learning from myself when I teach them. I will basically be able to teach them how to appreciate the culture even more. And this is not just the East Indian students and youths of Belize, but this will be everyone. I want to let them be aware and to appreciate the East Indian culture even more. Belize is the only country that hasn't been doing this type of dance. Guyana, Suriname, Trinidad, Jamaica, these indo caribbean countries have connected to their heritage through dance. Belize is the only country that hasn't been doing so. And I'm pleased to say that I'm the only person who is trying my best to do so. And I'm, as long as I have the health and strength, I will continue to do that. And I really want to share my passion with others so that eventually I can create my own dance group so that with this dance group, we can go to different places, represent Belize. For example, Carifesta will be next year. I believe that will be in Barbados. Imagine if I had a dance group already set up. We'd be able to go to Barbados to represent Belize in this dance style we will have opportunities to go to Puerto Barrios again, or to Trinidad, or even to Guyana again, or all over the different region, or who knows. 
Uh, I do know several people who went to, port, to Poland for dance. Imagine that an that, uh, Hindu Belizean dance group is able to go to somewhere like Poland again to represent Belize in this type of dance style. Mm -hmm.